Welcome back to the channel, guys. Today we have seven 100% free AI tools for you guys to use and to love because these tools are mind blowing. Let's start with the first one, which is Layapix. Now, for Layapix, what it does is it converts your pictures into animations and they can be up to six seconds long. So let's go ahead and click on upload and let's just pick out a picture that we want to animate. So I'll choose this picture right here and I'll click upload. Now, as you can see, it has now animated that regular picture into an actual animation. And if you click over here on the parameters, you can check on animation length and we can either make this a one second animation all the way up to a six second animation. So if you click on one second, it's going to make that loop go really fast. And if you go all the way over to six seconds, it's going to slow that one down. So I like to keep it on six seconds because too much motion, it might make you sick. So let's just keep it on six seconds. And it's a nice slow animation, which gives our picture a really, really cool effect makes it look 3d almost now if you click underneath it you can change the animation style for how it moves so you could put it in a circle you can put it in horizontal motion you could put it in vertical or the newest one which is perspective so that's going to zoom in and out then you can change the amount of motion you can go with less go with regular or you can go with more which gives it a ton of motion i'm going to keep it on less just because it looks better to me and then you can change the focus point where you want it to focus on the edge dilation so if you see that it looks distorted around the edge you can play around with that and see so yeah that's leia pics and that's how you animate a photo completely for free now when you want to save it you're just going to click on this button here that says share and it's going to bring up this box here and what you're going to do is just click on mp4 in order to save it to your vice and you click save all right so the next tool up on our list is going to be playgroundai.com now here is playground and i'll just go back to the home page right now we'll click on community feed and these are images that have been generated by other people and as you can see, you can create some amazing, amazing pictures from photorealistic pictures to cartoon animated Disney Pixar style pictures, anime to hyper realistic. So you can create anything that you can think of and it's 100% for free. You do not need Discord. It's ran in your browser. So all you got to do is go to playgroundai.com and you can generate some amazing pictures and if you want to get a feel for how to create a really good prompt what you can do is just click on an image that you really like that somebody's already made and you could just take a look at their prompt you can copy their prompt and then you can alter it a little bit to some, create something new or you can go ahead and remix their prompt where it will automatically input everything that they created on their prompt so as you can see it just inputted their whole prompt over here to our board and this is where you create your images now up here is a bunch of different filters that you could try out now they use this one niji se so you can click on that or you can change it to more realistic one and you can just go ahead and click generate and we'll see what we come up with now over on the right hand side are some other parameters that you could play around with the image dimensions you can also change the prompt guidance so if you move the slider to the right the more you move it to the right the more the image is going to stick to exactly what you've prompted there's a really cool picture there and you can change how many images it outputs so you can move it all the way up to four image four images for every generation so every time you generate a prompt you will get four images if you click over here on four you can do the three two or one i love it i'm biased towards playground ai because i've been using this for years this is one of the first ai tools that i've ever used and it's just gotten better and better so the next one that we have you guys is going to be pika labs so if you haven't used pika labs before it is another 100% free AI tool. So real quick guys, just go ahead and subscribe to the channel because I am bringing you 
the real free tools. If you want to find free tools that you can use at your discretion without being cut off, without being limited, without having a pop up telling you that your free trial is over and you need to buy such and such amount of credits, go ahead and subscribe to the channel because I am bringing you guys all the free tools and it's getting harder and harder to find free tools every video that goes on but that's what i'm doing for you guys so make sure you go ahead and subscribe to the channel now back to pika labs this is free and you're going to go ahead and download discord which is also free and when you do that you're going to go over to one of these rooms generate four generate five whichever so just click on one of these rooms and you're going to go ahead and type in the message you're going to type slash create and you're going to enter in a prompt so you could say, make her eyes blink, make her head turn to the left. Okay, so we'll put that as the prompt, make her eyes blink, make, let me just fix that, make her head turn to the left. And right here where it says plus one more, we're going to click on that and we're going to click on image. And we're going to upload an image and it's going to animate that image. Okay, so I'll just stick with the image that we used for the first tool, Layapix. So we'll use this one again. And we're going to come back over here and we're going to hit enter. So now, due to the fact that we are in Discord, we have to wait for our turn in line. Here it is. It's now created our animation out of the picture that we uploaded. So let's go ahead and click play and see what it's made. So it hasn't made much movement, but what it did was make her eyes blink just like we prompted. And look at that, we just made this image come to life. So that is Pika Labs. Now let's move on to the next free tool. Remember guys, the links for these tools are gonna be in the description below. And also make sure to subscribe to the channel so you can stay up to date with all these free tools that I'm giving you. Now this is ideogram.ai and as you can see, if you haven't seen this tool before, this is a text to image generator. The reason why I like this one so much is as you could see, look at the text. It's able to do text within the image, okay? Unlike all of the text to image generators that can't produce text within the image, this one can do that. Graphics for t-shirts, okay? This one I could see this one on a on a t-shirt. Maybe we can go ahead and remix this one. Large swordfish jumping out of the water. Okay, so we'll switch it up to a large swordfish jumping out of the water. We'll go ahead and generate that image. Some of these, you can see that the word wasn't spelled out correctly, right? So what you can do is, since this one is spelled out correctly, we can click on this one. And we now have one that is what we like, but we might want some more detail. And I'm going to click Remix. And now it's going to use this as an image to image. So let's go ahead and generate it again. And we'll get another four images. And hopefully it'll come out a little bit better. And it'll be spelled correctly. And it looks like, it looks like one of them is spelled wrong. They put two T's. But... As you can see, we now have about three that are spelled correctly. So once you get one that's spelled correctly, you're going to want to click it and you're going to want to click remix. And then you should start honing in on that correct image. And you should just get sm slight variations on the image, but you're going to get the one that you want and that's spelled correctly. So I really like this one right here. This is really cool. So let's, we can even try and remix this one again since I really like those colors. You can easily use these in order to create t-shirt designs or to create poster designs or to create logos or to create stickers. It's just so many opportunities that you can use this for and it's free and, all, and it's all web-based in your browser. So just go to ideagram.ai and you can start making these awesome graphic designs. If you guys like free tools, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Now the next one up is going to be called Debunked. 
This is a tool that helps you figure out in the age of misinformation, is it true or is it not? Now, this is an extension. So if I go up here and I click on my extensions, you could see that I've already downloaded this. So it pops up in this little box and it gives you a window where you can type in a statement and you can find out what well, is that statement true or is it not? It also has a spot for AI image detector. So you can upload an image and you can figure out if that was generated by AI or if it's a real picture. Sloss are lazy. Now, as you can see, it provides a lot of information as to whether or not the statement is true. So it says that it's a common mis misconception and slots are not lazy, but rather that they have evolved to move slowly and conserve energy due to their low metabolic metabolic rate and diet, which consists mainly of leaves that provide little energy and nutrients. Now let's move on to tool number six. It's called text effects. And this is by Google. So this is a really awesome tool for artists or for writers, anybody involved with content creation. It's basically 10 tools in one and it has to do with language. So it's supposed to help expand the writing process by generating creative possibilities with text and with language. Okay, so if you just go over here and you click on wrap, you'll see that what it does is for this tool wrap, it creates an acronym for a word. So let's just try to launch text effects and we'll see how to use it. Now it's gonna ask us to enter a word. So let's just enter a word. So let's just type in party and we'll run that and it will slot a word into other words or phrases so party turns into house party or dance party or party animal or tea party so it keeps giving you more and more options party bus party on okay now if we try a different one let's try rap this should create an acronym so we'll type in party and we'll see if it can create us an acronym for party. Party, people arriving, rejoicing, twerking, and yelling. Okay, <laughs> all right, so there's an acronym that it just made. How about alliteration? Let's try party, and we'll try alliteration. Now, as you can see, this is a tool that will be helpful to writers and maybe music artists that can help be creative with their language. So party starting with A, acapella, after party, after party, amuse, anniversary, aperitif, appetizer, applause. So it's gonna give you everything that starts with an A because an alliteration is when words start with the same word or excuse me, when they start with the same letter. Okay, so how about chain? This should build a chain of semantically related items. So let's try party again and see what type of chain it's able to create. Party, celebration, holiday, gift, package, box, present, ribbon. So this is a really cool tool and they have more, they have 10 total, I believe, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, there's 10 tools in one, and it's all to help make writers become more creative in the language that they're using. So that's tool number six. Now let's move on to tool number seven, our final tool for today that is completely free for you guys to use. So this one is going to be Nero. Okay, and remember the links are in the description. Okay, so Nero for this one is another face animation tool. So let's go ahead and upload a picture and we'll see what it's able to create. So we're just going to use the same picture that we've been using for the past couple of times. That way we can. Okay, so it's detected a face. So we're going to go ahead and click start so that it is going to animate that face. And yeah, so this tool is free and Nero also has a couple more free tools on this site. 
So I will show you those tools in a second, but first I want to see how it's able to animate this face for free. Okay, so there you go, guys, right there. It has taken that picture and it has animated the face. She's smiling, she's blinking. So that's pretty cool to be able to take a picture and animate it just like that in a couple of seconds for free. And now, of course, if you like it, you just click over here and download your animation. And just like that, it has downloaded as a GIF file. Okay, so that is the last one. And let me just show you real quick. It has photo restoration, which is another free tool. So you could take your old pictures and you can restore them to a fresh new look. Uh, it also has colorized photos. So if you have an old black and white picture, you can instantly colorize your photo. And it also has an avatar generator, which is for free as well. So there's about four, one, two, three, four tools that are completely free to use on Nero. And this one, if you upload a couple of pictures of your face, it's going to be able to turn it into a really cool avatar that you can use for profile pictures or anything really that you want. So yeah, that's it. That's Nero. That's a completely free tool right there. And that is the seven free tools of the day for AI guys. Now, if you don't like getting tools that have free trials, when people are making it, when people are promoting them as if they're free tools and come to find out they're free trials. There's nothing more frustrating than thinking you're going to be able to use this tool for a long time. And you find out that really you only had a couple tries at it and now you got to start paying for it. If you get frustrated just like I do with stuff like that, well, go ahead and subscribe to the channel because I'm going to be bringing you the real free tools, guys, every single day. So subscribe to the channel and make sure you click this video right here because I'm going to show you some more free tools in this video that you'll be able to use without paying a single dime. All right, I'll see you in this video, guys. Have a good one.